Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Hi Sagittarius White Sign. Today I am going to do September monthly love reading and this is general, may or may not resonate to everyone. So take what resonates and read the rest. If you like my content, please do like the video guys, then it will reach more people. And thank you so much for supporting me. So let's see your message with Sagittarius White Sign, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. So let's see the present scenario in your love life, Sagittarius. Page of Swords under the Knight of Cups. So you both have very strong emotions towards each other. Definitely deep emotions are there. But at the same time, Page of Swords, it's all about spying on each other on social media. Uh, keeping an eye on each other's movement on social media. So let's clarify Page of Swords. Under the deck, Nine of Swords, a lot of overthinking is going here. Judgment. King of Wands and the Hermit. Some of you, yeah, you both are talking, but there is no constant communication. For some of you, both are in no contact also. That's why you both are in, uh, you both are spying on each other. So here two cases. One case, you both are in separation. Other case, yes, you both are talking with each other, but there is no constant communication. Uh, so judgment, getting clarity. And King of Wands, a lot of passion and attraction. That's why you both are spying on each other. So such stages, let's see your person current feelings towards you. Wow, night of wheels. With the hermit, they deeply, deeply thinking about you. Uh, for some, maybe if you're in separation because the hermit, definitely a person is deeply thinking about you a lot. At the same time, they're thinking about you very positively. They're thinking about stability. Uh, some of you are dealing with Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, especially Virgo, it's Psy. If you're not in separation, definitely they're thinking about stability, commitment, marriage here. So let's clarify next of wheels. Under the deck temperance, some of you are dealing with under Sagittarius. King of Cups, the Empress and Queen of Swords. They're thinking that you're very powerful, independent, but at the same time, you love this person a lot. They know all these things, but sometimes uh, you talking with them very rudely. So they're thinking uh, the positive side of you at the same time, the negative side of you, Sagittarius. But your person is very positive uh, because uh, they really want to be with you and uh, every human has negative sides. So, so they know. Because Queen of Swords, sometimes you are very blunt, Sagittarius. But at the same time, you, sh you show so much love to them. Uh, so that's why you person really thinking about stability here. So let's see your feeling towards them. Your current feelings towards your person. The magician and king of swings. So you are practicing something regarding this relationship, communication, and commitment here. Sagittarius. So let's clarify the magician. Five of Wands under the deck. So again, the magician, definitely Sagittarius, you are manifesting. You are manifesting this person or you are manifesting this connection. Uh, some of you, you are feeling heartbroken. Some of you are healing here, the star. With healing, uh, at the same time, you are manifesting here. The magician came twice in this reading. 
the star some of you are dealing with aquarius definitely you are manifesting this relationship especially for those who are in separation you are doing all the techniques so i see your person next action towards you Sagittarius will pose the next action. See, Ace of Wands under the deck, Queen of Swords. Maybe they're not uh, expressing their feelings, uh, but they want a new beginning here. Uh, but they're not revealing their plans to you. Uh, so let's clarify Ace of Wands. They have a lot of passion towards you, Sagittarius. Three of Cups, Nine of Swords. Four of Wands and the Emperor. They are overthinking about this relationship. They're losing their nights over you. Definitely they're thinking about stability and commitment. Uh, due to your personal nature, they're not revealing their plans to you, but they're thinking about stability, commitment, new beginnings because Ace of Wands with Four of Wands, marriage. For those who are in relationship, they want to get married to you. They want to take this relationship to next level. Some of you are dealing with Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. So let's see a person through intention, Sagittarius. The true intentions, definitely they don't want to be in this energy 10 of wands with 4 of cups. They want progress, they want expansion. That's why they're thinking about new beginnings because 10 of wands with 4 of cups, uh, sitting alone, uh, thinking about the past and missing each other. And at the same time, your person is feeling overburdened. So they don't want to be in this energy. So that's why uh, they're thinking about new beginnings. Maybe they're not revealing the true feelings to you, but uh, they're deeply thinking about you. They're deeply thinking about stability and commitment here. So let's see what is the outcome of this relationship and where this relationship is headed on. Strength, some of you are dealing with Leo, five sign. Three of swords, ten of cups and two of swords. See? Indecision. Again, break up, 10 of cups. Maybe for some third party marriage, kids involved here. Some of you, you know, you person already married, have kids, but you still want this person. But if you really involved in that type of situation, you will end up like this Sagittarius. If you're not involved in any third party, if you're not dealing with married man, uh, it's okay, but if you are dealing with a married man, definitely will end up like this three of swords energy. See, again, four of cups. So even though they're coming towards you, again, you both will mess up with each other. What I'm getting here. Yeah. See, the outcome says everything. Four of pentacles, eight of cups, walking away from each other and wheel of fortune. Again, divine timing plays key role. So it is better to focus on yourself if you are really dealing with a married person. Uh, because I am not seeing any positive outcome here. Yes, your person want a new beginning. They are really passionate about you. But if you if third party involved here, it is not worth waiting for. At the same time, if you really reconcile with each other, then again some issues will happen. Three of swords with two of swords. Indecision. Clarity is missing. Maybe your person want you but they don't want to give enough time, enough attention to you. So that is also uh, insult to you because they need to uh, give time and attention to you. Because uh, if you want this person, that doesn't mean you have to lose your self-respect, Sagittarius, what I'm getting here. Uh, because uh, every person needs attention and affection and responsibility, but your person is not giving to you. Yes, they have passion for you, but they will do it when it is convenient for them what i'm getting here that's why uh, the stability is not happening uh feelings okay but action wise and the outcome it is better to walk away sagittarius so let's see what is the advice for sagittarius regarding this relationship 
See, five of swords, it's king of cups and four of wands. So some backstabbing energies here, uh, negative intentions maybe. If you let go of this person, someone brand new will come to you and will offer stability. Sagittarius, you will have options. So see, if you are expecting this from this person, again, ten of swords, you will be in this situation and the hermit ghosting. So it's up to you. But you are going through a lot emotionally in this relationship. Yeah, they will say so many things. They will talk to you. But when there is when uh, there is convenient for them, it's not about you. It's all about them. What I'm getting here. Some of you are dealing with Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. So this is the reading for you guys. Hope it resonates to you. Please do share, like and subscribe my channel and click the bell icon. Then you will get all my video notifications. Thank you so much for watching and supporting me. Please do like the video guys. Thank you.